right, so what we're going to be doing is testing this coin that we sent in to NGC. It was a 1851 Charlotte that uh, they call not genuine. So we're basically just going to test to see if it's real gold. So I've got my Sigma here, I've got my wand. Basically you want that bracket, or the uh, little box there to go between the bracket. So it looks like it, it's gold, just not 90%. Pretty close to, but not 90%. That was the first gold coin we tested. Get it there, back in the holder, 1851. Nice picture. I took nice pictures of these before I submitted them to NGC. Um, well, just because the condition of the coins were so similar, uh, this is a rare coin, so I just so gold, but uh, as you can see, not uh, nearly 90% close to, but not exactly. So gold, yes, but let's see. Got my gloves. Let's see if we can try it. And then we also had one more. It was 1849. Come back as counterfeit. And it's three gold dollars. So all came back as counterfeit. So. So the trouble with buying raw coins is there's so many fake ones out there, you never know what you're going to get. The nice thing about buying certified is you know that they're real. Alright, let's see. This is the uh, 1849. She got right on so that little spot right there in the back. See if we can just go back in there. Nope, it's a one time fluke. So, see the three of the four coins that we sent in the gold coins, I should say, did come back counterfeit alone. Winner. This is 1912, two and a half gold. And you can erase that with the AU55. So sorry I missed this one. I forgot about the gold there. It was in the back of the box. Um, World Coins coming up next. So stay tuned. Thanks again for watching. Bye.